the, the, there's a lot of anger, and this is what this is. This is a lot of anger, and what these assaults have done is they fed into the fears of people, and it's given them an excuse, an opportunity to come out onto the streets like this and vent their frustrations, their fears, and their angers using beer bottles that are being thrown, using fireworks, using slogans and big signs that say, refugees not welcome. One of them said, rape, you, ref, refugees not welcome. Uh, so there is that boiling anger that's now surfacing for, this I should point out, is a small segment of German society, but it is a very vocal one. On the other side of the station, we see 1,700 protesters in support of those victims of the assaults, in support of continuing to open the doors to refugees. But what this kind of tension shows is that deep divide in society. Is this, uh, Atika, contained to this, this single street, this single intersection? Uh, how broad uh, is this group? Are they spread across several blocks? It's difficult to tell from this, this camera angle. It's actually fairly contained. This is only contained, we can, uh, it's contained to just a few hundred. You can see the water cannon now in use. They've sort of sprayed quite a number of the protesters. There's the water. This is their way of saying, you know, move out of the way, stop this protest, we will disperse. This behavior is continuing there. And we can see the water cannon spraying directly into the crowd there to get them to move, to get them to uh, disperse as soon as possible.